Young and the restless spoilers reveal attentions between Sharon and Heather bring surprises, recent events bring a wave of unexpectedly intense emotions that have many questioning their relationships and their choices. At the center of it all, Sharon and Heather's confrontation sends ripples through the community, while Phyllis Summers desperately tries to unite her family around Lucy. Meanwhile, Claire Grace Newman and Summer find themselves bonding in unexpected ways, each navigating the complexities of their newfound connection to the Newman family. Sharon has been battling her inner demons for some time, and her conversation with Mariah only underscores the depths of her turmoil. Mariah, always perceptive, notices that her mother's behavior is becoming increasingly erratic. When Sharon confesses that she often finds herself not talking to anyone when she's alone, Mariah is deeply concerned. Sharon tries to brush it off as the aftermath of her recent car accident, but Mariah senses something more sinister is going on. The way Sharon talks, almost as if she's warning someone, makes Mariah uncomfortable. Sharon's frustration grows as she realizes she can no longer hide her emotions. She tries to apologize for her outburst, but her eyes are still locked on Cameron from across the room. Her intense gaze betrays a deep anger, one that she struggles to contain even around her loved ones. Mariah, sensing the tension, tries to steer the conversation away from Cameron, but Sharon's thoughts are elsewhere. The mention of Mariah's late sister, Cassie, only makes things worse, leading to a tense exchange between mother and daughter. Ultimately, both women apologize, but the damage is done. Summer and Claire Grace Newman find themselves sitting on a park bench, sharing an awkward but necessary conversation. The subject of Harrison, the boy who has brought so much joy and pain to their lives, acts as an icebreaker. As they laugh together, the tension between them begins to melt. Summer asks Claire about the contents of her shopping bag. Claire, with a mix of excitement and anxiety, reveals that she plans to change her last name to Newman. She pulls out a family tree, now updated to include her name, symbolizing her desire to fully integrate into the family she aspires to be a part of. Summer, ever the kind person, reassures Claire that she is already a valued member of the family, regardless of her name. Their conversation then turns to work with Summer asking about Nikki Newman's job offer to Claire. There is a hint of concern in Summer's voice, as she hopes Claire won't pass up the opportunity. The two women share a common understanding of what it means to be connected to the powerful Newman family, and despite their differences, they find common ground in their experiences. Back at the Summer's mansion, Phyllis is deeply concerned about Lucy. Recent events have caused the young woman to act out of character, and Phyllis fears that the strain on their family relationship is affecting her. Nick, always the voice of reason, refuses to blame anyone, including Lucy. However, Phyllis can't help but worry that the stress of their complicated lives is affecting her daughter. The conversation inevitably turns to Sharon, who has been struggling since Faith's accident. Phyllis, despite her past with Sharon, expresses genuine concern for her well-being. She fears that recent events may be pushing Sharon to the brink of collapse, a fear that seems more justified as the days go by. As Sharon continues to stare at Cameron, Mariah can't shake the feeling that something terrible is happening. She tries to pull Sharon's attention away from him, but her efforts are futile. Sharon, lost in her thoughts, denies that she's looking at anyone in particular, but her distant expression tells a different story. Mariah's anxiety grows when she mentions Cassie, hoping to snap Sharon out of her trance. Instead, Sharon reacts with anger, tired of the constant reminders of her past trauma. As Sharon wrestles with her inner demons, Summer and Claire find solace in each other, while Phyllis struggles to keep her family together. Cameron's presence adds complexity to an already chaotic situation, leaving everyone on edge. Subscribe to Yonder for the latest updates.